The MAD program was good for me because I learned a lot about myself as a person, as a dancer, and as an entrepreneur. It's helped me develop myself as an artist and give me platforms to perform and engage with different audiences and build my career. It's kind of like a mentorship program. They're paying you to put out your content, which is unheard of. We started with 300 followers. Now we have 4,000 followers. So it's been useful to get that information in all the workshops. I'm still marinating on on things that were brought up in earlier workshops months ago. Really loved what we learned in the workshop before this from different people like Danny and learning about the arts presenting world within Ontario. Um, there's something that Crystal Kieran said to not only embrace just one side of your culture, your heritage, or where you come from, but to embrace or all sides of your um, of your culture and where you come from. So some things that I've learned in the workshop so far that really stood out was really looking at the demographics and what we need to do in order to get our target audience and really specifying specific goals and not just having kind of a general goal. When you get nitty gritty and really decide what your target audience is, that's how you're going to get the people and the fans to come and to stay. The session that we had with Vizzy was super enlightening. I wish I learned about a little bit earlier, to be honest, in my career as I was building this because some of the things that she was talking about are, are like gems in terms of growing yourself. We see this as a holistic program because you're not just learning or about creating your content, but then it's also how to put that content out there. Because we would not have this exchange otherwise. Like if it wasn't from Matt, we would still be trying to figure out the whole social media, influencing and knowing your insights and your target audience, but just having somebody to talk to one-on-one -on -one and being like, okay, you know, this is how you should plan your goal. This is how you should do it. Or these are some of the pointers. We learned uh, a lot of uh, organization to start with, uh, finishing up stuff and deadlines. Uh, we're honestly really pumped to see the final product of our MAD episode. We just saw it over lunch and we we're like, oh, we feel so famous and fancy. <laughs> <laughs> and it's kind of just nice to reflect on our journey and what we've done over the past few years. There's footage in there from us teaching and performing like four years ago and it's it made us actually emotional to look at it because we we're like look at all we've, that we've done i made a band page for the first time and, and since i created it last week i've been getting hits like non-stop you know it's, it's really good and especially since this morning we posted a, a little documentary thing i just been watching i've been getting messages and pinging on my phone like i i keep going on and about the video because i honestly that was like one of the wickedest productions we've ever had you know, if you're doing well for yourself, why not take the opportunity to get more skills, more resources, more training to push yourself even further? And I think beyond just the chance to perform and you know, put your craft out there and work with others, I think the, the skills training aspect of it is what really makes me want to recommend this to anybody who wants to keep doing music. We literally struggled a lot in order to get our show. So you can say that uh, we were, you know, that particular plant who was almost about to die. But when Monster Rity came into picture, it watered us, we got nurtured. We are blooming right now. Right now we have a lot of fans or people reaching out to us. It's nice to be able to connect with other artists. I think that's been pretty amazing for us because usually we're in our own little bubble of creating and performing. So it's nice to see other dance artists, but also other artists. Like we're connecting with musicians as well. And it's nice to see their perspective. It helped me to discover a lot of confidence and hidden abilities in myself that I otherwise wouldn't have known I had. 